Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to change your WEP of your 2-wire gateway router. Um, this is a wireless encryption key people use to um, connect to your network. So the reason you want to do this is if, if you sometimes notice um, other computers on the network that you don't know. Um, so I'm going to be showing you how to change the password, the encryption key so other people can't use it only your computer or computers in your house so what you need to do is go to open any internet browser you have type in um, gateway dot two wire dot net it'll take you to the administrator panel and um, what you need to do is click on home network up here it might look different but just look somewhere it says home network and then here you can see the computers connected to your network and if you notice computers that you don't know uh, that means other people are connected to your network and they're getting free internet from you um, so to change that go to edit settings and then it's gonna ask for a password um, just enter your system password um, if you don't know it you can call your internet service provider and maybe they can tell you your password Okay, so enter your password. Hit submit. And then here you'll see all your um, settings for your router. Um, this is the encryption key your router has. With this key, anybody can gain access to your network if they're close to you and they can still get a signal. So, like if you invite people to your house, they could easily just um, um, read the. WEP off your router on the bottom and they, they could write it down and they could use it um, so that's how um, people can steal it or whatever so right here make sure this is enabled on wireless security if it's not enabled then people don't need a password to connect to your network and that means that anybody can just connect to it but you need to have that enabled on here WP open and then this is going to be checked on use default encryption key make sure you this one you select this one um, so click here and then enter a 10 digit key and make sure you write it down because you're going to need it for later so once you type in the new key you want to hit save and then that's it and then uh, what you need to do is restart your computer and then once you restart you'll see here that it's going to have a little shield on there that means you can't connect to your internet and you'll have no internet so what you need to do to fix that is click, go to the network ensuring sensor on Windows 7 you just click here on um, other operating system type in network and the sharing center to open that and then on your home network here or I'm not sure how you do it on this, but uh, for Windows 7, all you do is click here. You'll see this. These are the the routers that are close to you and that you can connect to for internet. Um, yours will appear, uh, two wire or whatever it is, and you'll see a shield there. What you need to do to get back your internet is right click and then properties, and then under the security tab here, enter the new wireless encryption key that you entered in your internet browser so if you didn't write it down then uh, just go back to your internet browser and go to 2r.gateway.net and make sure you write it down this time alright so enter the new WEP there and hit OK and in a few seconds it'll refresh and you have wireless internet again and your internet should work normally so that's how you change the wireless encryption key on your 2R gateway router um, so if this tutorial helped, please subscribe and rate this video 5 stars. I'm not sure how you do this on other routers, um, just google it how to change your WEP on your router. And yeah, I guess that's it and goodbye.